Hey yo, what the word is? What's happening? What's popping? Real quick, real quick. Whoa. I was just about to say, before these boxes start sliding, uh, they put this shoe in a way bigger box than it should be. But, real quick, real quick, real quick. Let's get into it. Because I want to check these things out. Like, I don't want to talk and whatnot, but we're going to go with that sneaker karma knife. I'm excited to see these in hand. Oops. Opened it upside down. They're the same shoe, so. Let's get into it. I'm just gonna leave that one on display. These are mean. These are freaking mean, yo. Look at that. Blinging? Sheesh. Pins, lace locks, lace locks. These are so damn sick. The leather on these, beautiful. Oh man, these things smell amazing. It is only one side that the bling does come on, but I mean, you could go ahead and customize that yourself, you know, however you want, whichever side you want to wear your jewelry, your, your sneaker jewelry on, you rock that shit, man, just, just give me a moment, like, to appreciate this, because it's not often Nike throws a nice leather. Like this on a, on an Air Force, let alone a women's exclusive Air Force, you know? Nike, for the most part, will skip out on giving the women quality. But uh, it looks like that's going to change. Because. This one. This one's so freaking dope. Uh, the laces are like a like a cream white. Uh, they are like that wax lace. Your check on both sides. Yeah. And both shoes. Um, it's got... On the pictures I saw on their website, it looked like it was more like a embossed quilted uh leather but here it looks more like a 
not necessarily like a crinkle or wrinkled leather, but we'll say uh, a bigger tumbled leather joint, you know? Looks a little cool to the video, but these things, these things are fly, you know? Um, as for your tongue, they left it exposed, the sponge right there. They have this like clear netting around it. That reminds me of like a tutu. Can y'all see that? Yeah. These are hard, man. I need I need a, a women's twelve, which is a men's ten and a half. Uh, they did come out in twelve. I wasn't able to hit on a twelve, so I said, "Yo, you know what? Let's go down the size chart, see what we can hit." We hit on two pairs. Um, this is a. This is an 11. Look at that. Look at that size difference. You know? Uh, but yeah. This women's 11 is a men's 9.5. So, I got a men's 9.5. I got a women's 7.5. As for the seven and a half, I'm not too sure uh, if it's sold. I had a homie. Uh, shout out to Footwork Fanatics. Uh, those are the real sneaker plugs, man. Straight up. Make sure your pockets are ready. Shoes ain't cheap. A plug ain't cheap. But they're the homies. Super plugged in. Um... We've been going back and forth and talking and whatnot, and they said that uh, they were getting hit up for sizes, and they asked me, like, yo, what sizes did you hit on, like, you know? Um, so I told them that I had a women's 11, men's 9.5, and, and I had a women's 7.5. And They're like, oh, all right, we'll, we'll, we'll keep you posted. But shout, shouts to them, man. Super good peoples over there. Let them know I sent you. Let them know. Um, you know, maybe, maybe, maybe they'll hook you up with a discount. Maybe they'll throw your boy some free shoes or something, you know, one of the two. Um, I prefer y'all to get the deals, but I mean, we'll see. I'll talk, I'll talk to them. But yeah, nah, these are super clean. I'm, try I'm trying to think if it would have been a little too much or if it would have been an extra nice little touch. If they did the lace aglet, maybe, because the way it was hitting the light right now, it looked like a pearl, but it's not pearl. Um, maybe if they did like a plastic pearl coating or something, you know, around it, with the jewelry, the white, cream laces that tan champagne tongue I don't even know if y'all can see that right there. these are these are super beautiful I'm gonna I'm gonna need to show these to my sister man cuz uh, if footwork if footwork don't sell them uh, or have a buyer for them you know they might just stay in the family. These are too clean. I definitely need that men's ten and a half. Uh, just a heads up, Air Forces do run a little big sometimes. Uh, I recommend everyone go down half a size. 
some people will recommend you all to go down a full size. Me personally, it's just half a size, you know? My Travis Scott's, my John Elliott's, uh, my D-Books, my Skeletons, all 11. I'm a true 11 and a half. Um, even in Jordan 1's, I go down half a size. I go down to an 11, uh, lows and highs. We don't do mids. But, <laughs> enough talking. Oh, damn. That branding sweet. Let's do it on. Let's see. Yeah, we got. Let me show it better on this one. You got your Nike Air Force branding? Wow. On my tongue. Um, and that's really it, man. Leather, cream laces. Oh, shit. It's also in the back that's got that big tumbled quilted leather like, you know? Embroidered uh, Nike Air branding on the back. This is just a freaking clean Air Force One overall. Ladies, I suggest you all pick it up. These will be popping. Uh, shouts to Crystal Poppin. She's always popping. Her fits, A1. But yeah, no, ladies, these are sick. Uh, depending on what my sister says, this, may, this pair may be available. Uh, fellas, these ain't just for the ladies, you know. Nine and a half, what is it? It means eight through ten and a half is uh, in women's sizing. Get a pair. I suggest you get a pair because in a year or two, maybe even less, man, these things are going to go crazy. Like, this is something you can wear and people are going to like break neck a little, sun hit it. <sighs> Their neck is done. Uh, but yeah, Laters, I'm out. Peace. Love y'all. God bless. Uh, yo, y'all see that baseball jersey? Uh, yeah. I want to say there was only like, yeah, there was only three made. Gotta get them pre-orders in, you know? Uh, this is back when I first started, but uh, yeah. Pre-orders, that's where it's most limited.